What's up, YouTube? This your girl, Lofty Lee, and we is here with another reaction video. We is about to react to Tea Room. She just dropped a video. It is titled, Jordan Put Hands on Sierra. Okay. Maddie responds to Carmen filing cease and decease. <laughs> decease. Um, okay. And Queen reacts to Tina. We finna go ahead and get Well, it's time to find it. a new apartment on Zillow. Um, like, comment, and subscribe. Leave down below what you guys think. Yeah, so it look like Carmen filed that cease and desist to what you call it. And yeah, I guess she's still talking. But we finna see what she said. What was her comment? What was, her, what was Maddie's response? So, hey, we ain't gonna talk too much on this situation. We gonna let them handle this. Let the courts handle it. Because I don't got time for them to be coming at me. Thank you guys for uh, letting me know in, 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 my, in my messages. But, hey, <laughs> let's go ahead and get straight into it. Um, What we doing? What we doing? Let's get it. Let's go. Let's see. And Jordan, I don't know. I don't know. We finna see what about what's going on with Jordan and Sierra. But, all right. Hold on, hold on, hold on. With the situation with Carmen's lawyer. Now so previously I spoke with okay. the situation with Carmen's lawyer now putting a cease and desist on Corey's girlfriend, Maddie, as well. What appears that Maddie has indirectly responded to Carmen's lawyer. She stated, I'm not scared. To uh, I'm always heavy my having my way. I'm not scared to get on you bad side. Y'all ain't nobody. Okay. To get on you B-words bad side, y'all ain't nobody. But I will say, Corey and Maddie both do go on live a lot, and now they've both been really quiet. Maddie has yeah, now stopped nothing. going live as well. But let's move on to this next topic with okay. Queen Nyjah mm -hmm. and Tina. Now, I recently... Re Better girl that wasn't no response <laughs> but Pablo was but she ain't really say nothing she ain't say nothing Hell. too crazy but let's move on to this next topic with Queen Nyja and Tina now I recently reported that Tina was auditioning for the show Baddies and it appears that Queen Nyja has now endorsed her sister she states I'm yeah. screaming what is going on man she states, y'all got to put Shout her. out to Tina for getting out here doing her thing. You feel me? She going to be on Betty's Midwest, ain't it? It's called Midwest, Miss e Mid-East, something like that. But, hey, Tina on Betty's. Hey, I might have to pay that subscription so I can see Tina turned on the show for show. <laughs> her on the show. For she sure. then tags Natalie and Zeus. So, Queen is all the way supporting her sister being on the show bad so you guys leave wish? your opinions slinging. on that down or <laughs> being on the who win tina got slinging in hell the show baddies so you guys leave your opinions on that down in the comment section below but let's move on to this next topic with <laughs> jordan and sierra okay. recently jordan came out and shared that sierra actually served him with child support papers okay. then sierra came back and responded and gave her side of the story okay now sierra mentioned something that caught a lot of people i really haven't been paying too too close attention to this situation but i have been seeing it but uh yeah i ain't really speaking out on this for real because i don't know off guard now if you guys remember when the whole Flo and karina thing was going on and jordan posted that he didn't condone any violence or domestic violence and people were now if jordan 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 if you put your hands on sierra please yeah you better not after what happened to Flo with us uh, karina and you set up pill you feel me you better not be putting your hands on sierra because <laughs> you about some feet tall Jordan sit this one out, my boy. Sit this one out. He well, 
Sierra said he's never physically hit me. Okay, hold on. Let's see. Let's see. Well, let's see what's going said on. Said that he didn't condone any violence or domestic violence. And people were saying, Jordan, you need to sit this one out. And then Sierra comes back and responds that Jordan don't got to sit this one out. He never physically hit me. Well, in her video, now she's stating that he did. Fighting with me while holding my baby in my hands. Mm. She hitting the floor. Not fighting with the baby and see her hands. Okay, now, now. Which one is it? Which one is it? Did he not hit you or did he hit you? Don't be getting on the internet. You feel me? Talking about, hey, he hit me. You chill out on Jordan. And then when y'all mad at each other, you want to come out and be like, oh, yeah, he hit me. He fighting me with my baby in my hands. Make me drop my baby. Which one is it? Because I don't know. Still fighting with me? I don't know using me it was crazy because when that whole situation was happening people were stating that sierra was just trying to save jordan because at that time they were good now she's ready to expose it all right. now people are actually getting on jordan because he posted a video entitled it officially moving my stuff uh, out the uh, foe house uh, oh I, ain't, I did see that but i ain't watch it yet i'm gonna watch it and see what he's talking about because why he's moving out the foe house Jordan, why the F do you keep uploading videos, then deleting them immediately after? Oh, did he delete that? You thought no one seen that? Officially moving out, moving my stuff out of the FOE house. Like, be for real. You real life, live, a freaking follower. He trying to do what uh, Flo did. <laughs> House. now people were upset because he quickly deleted this video after he uploaded it because he was getting slammed in the comment section people even had to go to his other video asking him why does he keep deleting videos because he doesn't want to hear the truth now uh -huh. these are clips from the video that jordan actually deleted ross we're going to work out going to run i don't know it just clears your head you know what i'm saying but uh I'm not in it just because I'm stressing y'all, but I'm in there for real because I do really, really like wanna. Well, I am stressing a little bit. I, ain't, I don't got nothing to hide with y'all. That's one thing y'all know. I'm transparent, stressing a little bit, but it's all it's okay, bro. I mean, we're gonna get through it. Um, but yeah, it, it's a it clears your head, man. Y'all, I'm already an overthinker, bro. And I just been thinking and thinking and thinking. And my main question is like, if my number is blocked and I want to see my daughter, even through all this BS, like I. I Picture this. You're sitting at home alone watching YouTube what's videos, going on, wondering why you can't find the motivation to do the thing. Even through all this business that's going on, because I hit it before, and I was like, yo, no response. Well, before that, before the yo, I said, when can I get Kinsley? Literally, I said, when can I get Kinsley? She didn't respond to me. Um, then I said, yo, she didn't respond to me. And then I just said, um, I said, are you going to let me see Kinsley, or are we just going to let the court get involved with this? I'm still blocked. Saying so, bro, even with all this BS going on, whoever signed y'all on, I, I really don't care, you know what I'm saying? Because I just want to be a, a father at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? I just, I just want to be a father, I want to be in my kids' life, like, I want to be a dad. Y'all know how many people in this world neglect their kids that don't want to right. see their kids, bro? Like, I don't, I don't understand, but yeah, bro, I never portrayed to be an internet father, y'all. I never portrayed to be a perfect father you know what i'm saying like oh that's what i'm saying i could see if i was on the internet and i was literally using my kid for views and using her for money but is he y'all is he i don't really watch jordan videos like that i watch omar videos and <laughs> if i watch one video out of the group i don't watch nobody else videos because they all you know hang around each other and do the same thing so they all showing pretty much the same thing. So if I watch a Mar video, I ain't watching Jazz video. I ain't watching Jordan or nobody else video. If I'm watching Jazz video, I ain't gonna watch a Mar video. I ain't gonna watch Jordan video because you know they uh, always they record the same thing because they you know a group and they vlog and they vlogging the same thing. So that's how. I, so I vlog um, around here because that's genuinely, what, genuinely what I want to do. I want to show y'all her. Like, I, I enjoy doing that. I really enjoy doing that. So, I, uh, this whole internet father or trying to fake be I a father, I bro, I don't get it. To you know what I'm saying, y'all? So, 
Cause I don't did you see that video? I'm not perfect. I never portrayed to be a perfect father. Nothing like that, dog. I'm just a young man, bro. That's just, just, just trying to be on his grind, bro. Trying to make sure everybody's straight and be a father at the same time. You know what I'm saying? So today, I know I'm not no bad person. I know I'm not no terrible person. I never neglect my daughter. I've never. There's never have been one time where. She asked me to do something for her, and I just told her no because I wanted to do it or I made up an excuse. Or, you feel me, y'all? So I'm not trying to win nobody over. I'm not trying to do that. At the end of the day, y'all going to believe what y'all want to believe, you know? But And I got receipts, too. You know what I'm saying? I got receipts of everything, but I'm not about to just well, drop them. I'm not about to do that. You know what I'm no, saying? drop them because Sierra dropping her receipts. Add <laughs> it to the fire. You know what I'm saying? Because no, you dropped your like, oh, receipts. She got receipts. What are your receipts? Bro, I have receipts too. Well, drop you know what I'm saying? I have receipts too. And drop the receipts to the judge to the judges. Cause at this point, the audience, the supporters, it's the judges. Cause y'all keep coming to the internet with y'all problems. So hey, we need to see the receipts so we can um give a verdict. <laughs> uh, yeah, but but we're not gonna do all that, man. We're not gonna do all that. We just gonna I, I wanna see her. Before we go to court and everything, we handle that. That's why I text her. I'm like, are you going to let me see my, my child, my daughter, or are we just going to let the court handle everything? Go on, go to court. Y'all, in, in, in that video that I had made when I went out of town and everything, and I was talking about you how I got a car stuff. and I so called got two houses two houses and everything. Uh -huh. Bro, I put this on everything. Like, I probably, I yeah, probably his came apartment off in now. a cocky way, but... I was not trying to come off in a cocky way, bro. Like y'all, if you know me, bro, and like you've been supporting me, bro, y'all know I'm one of the most humblest, most gratefulest content creators there is out here. You feel me, y'all? I never try to throw nothing in nobody's face or try to make it seem like I'm just doing this in life. I'm doing so well in life. Like I still face problems to this day. Like I'm human, just like you are. You feel me? But I was just explaining myself. You know what I'm saying? But I, I, I think I. I came off in like a wrong way. You know what I'm saying, y'all? Like I was just explaining myself, bro. Like I wasn't just trying to boast and be like, man, I'm doing this, I'm doing that. Well, you feel me? But at the same time, I had to- He was slip boasting, like, he I was. was. Trying to clear my name, you know? But I guess I came off in a cocky way because I keep seeing people talking about, man, humble yourself. You need to humble yourself, this and that. Bro, I'm very humble. You know what I'm saying? I communicate with y'all. I, I try to be as transparent with y'all as possible. You get what I'm saying, y'all? But. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man, I just had to get that off my chest because I've never, I never, never want to come off as cocky. I don't even like cocky niggas. Like, I, I hate when niggas do something or get something and then they start being cocky. So, I just want to apologize to my fans and to everybody that, that felt like I was just being too cocky with that. You know what I'm saying, bro? That was not the case. I was just explaining myself. I'm very blessed and grateful to be doing the stuff I'm doing. And I know for a fact, 100%, without God, without the people around me, without my team, without y'all, I would not be in this position. All right. I guess that's it, man. I don't know really too much too much about Sierra and Jordan's situation, but hopefully they can uh, get that situated. That's what these comments talking about. Uh, maybe we'll hush her mouth now. Folks are tired of her. No Carmen, no content. Sierra was protecting Jordan at that time. Now she's just doesn't give a freak i don't even watch youtube anymore i just watch the tea about them sierra and jordan both seem bitter they need to leave their child carmen got a, yeah hey about carmen and carmen and her defendants like <laughs> they is quiet bro they is quiet they is cool. Carmen got them quiet over there, bro. She stood on business and shut all of them up. You feel me? She said, Hey, you. <laughs> she said, I'm a mute y'all. Look around, everybody on mute, and they is on mute. Her way, she claimed they're not going, being a social media content creator. What she started doing. She in it. She in it. She in it. <laughs> but yo, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Until then, peace. I'm out, man.